Eko lo e wana mbebe mbondo. Wosala ole. Shekenena. Um, Ochina la ye so kele shito. Ad ne onu mwana ne eme bi angwa malenzo. Na ondi mshekene cha wangila yi kila. Ano ito atunde cha eme mbe e bondo. Na shi eta unso uto watu musala nga bile ye hi vocha wato. Bale eme mbe bonde. Amu wawo mshekene. Na amu wena bi kiangabe ngini. Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you already know, we are going to be learning a Bembe language. And in today's video, we are going to be learning how to call people in your family. That's immediate family and extended family members. Without taking much of your time, we're going to go straight into our video, into our lesson video. So, mother in... Okay, first of all, I'm going to start with a Bembe first and then translate it later to make it easier for us. Plus, we are going to be having subtitles, which will help you learn and have more resources around. So, ma, tata, achi, domi. Ma, tata, achi, domi. That is immediate family. Ma, it's mother. Tata, it's father. Achi is sister. Domi is brother. And then you have, you can call younger siblings or siblings. So, if you have siblings, you can say nto. If you have one sibling, you can say nto. And if you have a lot of siblings, you can say bato. Bato and nto. Maha, tata, dome, achi, nto. I think that's it for immediate family. Maha, mother, tata, father. Ndome, brother, Achi, sister. Now we are going to extended family members and we are going to start with um, dad's side first and then we are going to go to mother's side. Um, grandmother in my native language is called O O. O O is grandmother. And don't worry about writing it because you are going to see it there on your screen. O O. And then to make life easier and our lessons more shorter, O O it's O O on both parts, mother side or father side. Grandmother is O O, O O. And then grandfather it's also the same. Dad side and mom side, she O O. She O O it's um grandfather. And then going to um father side. We have got auntie and we have got half fathers or we can call, we call them uncles but in my native language um half father or uncle are called tata womanue if it's younger tata womanue that's my dad's young brother and if it's um, if the person is older than my father I'll call them tata wansoshi if it's young, my brother's, yeah, my dad's young brother, it's called Tata Wamanue. My dad's, yeah, bigger brother or big brother, elder brother, I um, will call him Tata Wansoshi. And then we come to auntie. Auntie in my native language is called China. China is auntie. That is dad's side and it's dad. Going to mother's side, which is going to finalize our lesson today. As I said before, I'm not going to repeat it, so we're going to go into um, uncle and um, auntie. But in my native language, it's different too. It's also different. So, my mom's brother, it's called Muicho. We call them Muicho, my, my mom's brother. And if my mother have got a sister, we call her Maha Wamanue, if she is younger than my mother. But if she is my mother's elder sister, I will call her Maha Wansoshi. If you would like more of this lesson or you want me to repeat it again, I would do advise you to be going back and forth while um, watching this video and you're going to have more, much more understanding of what I just said. So as for now, I'm going to say everything from immediate family in my native language to extended family both sides so that we can all be on the same page maha tata ndome achi if you have younger sibling nto or if there are many bato 
extended family dad side so we will say o oh, o oh. and then we will say she olo that is for both mom and dad we call them grandmother is o oh, o oh. grandfather is she olo and then that side if I, my dad have got a younger brother i will call i will call him tata womanue and if it's my dad's older brother tata wansoshi and if it's my dad's sister i will call her china and then my mom's side if my mother have got a brother i will call my mom's brother muicho and if she has got a big sister i will call my mom's big sister maha wansoshi and if she's younger i will call her Ma Wamanue, my mom's young sister. That was it for today. And um, if I made any confusion, please let me know down below. Just don't hesitate on writing your comments because you know we're all learning and that it's all part of uh, improvement. Thank you so much for your time, and I'm hoping to see you next um, in my next video. Don't forget to share, comment, like, and most importantly, learning. That's the end of our lessons today. Thank you for staying. Bye.